Hi and welcome back to Prime of Midlife. It's Monday and we all know what Monday's like at work. Um, it's been quite a busy day but not too bad. And I came home and started my spreadsheet for my prep stockpile. So proud of myself. I have got so much stuff. I did not think I had got so much stuff. I really didn't. Until you start looking at it in a spreadsheet and going, oh my goodness. Um, and then I thought, right, okay, I'll go up the stairs and I'll start on the, the second shelf down that had the veggies on it that I, I showed you last night. I was looking to start doing that one. So I've done some veggies, I've done some fruit, I've sharpened the dates on the top of the tins. That took me half an hour. But you know, I'm not impressed. For future reference, once the stockpile's sorted, when you add to it, you do, you know, add it to the list, do the sharpie on the day you bring it in, because this is going to take me for ever. Um, <laughs> yeah, I was quite surprised at how long it took. Um, so I decided I would just do a quick thing. So there I was going, oh yes, I need to show you this. And then I was like, oh, and I need to show you that. Oh, and I need to show you that. So the video after this bit is, is, is quite short. Um, you'll see where I've, I've organised my fruit and my veg and not organised the meat because, you know, I'm done. Um, I'm going to go and make a cup of tea and sit down. I have cake, so I'll be eating that. Um, but the non-food preps, I forgot I had non-food preps to show you yesterday. So I've added, I've showed you them, showed you the cat food and stuff like that. That you know, And it, it's something that I just wanted to say because how many of us have done it? You know, we're focused on this part of the stockpile and we've completely forgotten about the other bits. Um, and you can't forget about the other bits because you need to make sure that you're using them, you're rotating them. I mean, I just found a tin of mandarin segments, which I have to say, I presume has been in my cupboard for quite some time before I started prepping. Because the best before date is March 2022. So we'll be eating that very shortly. Obviously, we know that the tins are not going to go. Um, I also, as I was moving the, the meat stuff, found a chicken and white sauce that's dinked. So we'll be having that quite soon as well. There's no point in keeping them. They're not going to keep as long. So that will be part of our meals this week. Um, part of our meal tonight, we had um, a pork roast that I got quite cheap in Tesco's. And we used some of the roast parsnips and, turn and, parsnip, and carrots that I got in the Morrison's box last week. I had roasted them all, stuck them in a tray, put them in the freezer. So I literally took out a portion for Patrick and I and stuck them in the microwave for about five minutes. And when they came out, they were perfect. Oven roasted parsnips and carrots. So that's been put to good use. Um, rather than, you know, the carrots just sitting there going to waste or the parsnips because they were, you know, reduced because of their age. So yeah, hope you enjoy seeing the rest of the pantry that I completely forgot about. Um, but do let me know how what you're thinking. Um, I, I do want to say I am going to go through the comments and we'll have a video about comments just this week sometime. But thank you so much. Um, thank you for the comments. Thank you for the ideas. Thank you for the tips. Thanks about this, the shopping deals. Thanks for the subscriptions. Who knew that I would get subscribers? Um, just thank you for being part of this and thank you for making me not feel that I'm the only one thinking this. It's quite a nice feeling knowing you're not alone, isn't it? Um, so yeah, have a good night. I'll catch you later. Here we are again in my prepper pantry. This is me stocking up and taking note. Um, <clears throat> I have a lot of chopped tomatoes. Um, I also have new potatoes, sweet corn, peas, carrots. And I've got the Sharpie out. And we've been dating them all. That's my mushrooms at the back there. And I've left this space because, as we saw last night, there's more veg on the bed. So, oh. And I've got my fruit here. And this is some of the tinned meat that I've got so far. But I don't think I really want that in the same shelf as the fruit and veg. I think this shelf would be better just being fruit and veg. Now, I was going to... Put this all together on a spreadsheet um but i've sat and done the initial spreadsheet and that took me nearly an hour and i've been up here half an hour dating and sorting them out so really no 
that's not happening um but i will just show you bear with me a second um as we see we've we've got the mylar bags that need to go in a plastic box i know i know um sugar rice now obviously here's the heap that you saw last night over there in the heap toilet rolls and five gallon buckets i have three five gallon buckets as well um, the big thing of clothes is my daughter's stuff. So, yeah, there's, looking at it now, there's an awful lot to do and I'm working this week and I really can't be bothered. Oh, and that there, that's my spare sugar as well. Oh, and the cat food. And I've got some water and a light bulb that needs to go in the bin. Um, yeah. Oh, yeah. And over here non-food preps yeah non-food preps they're very important by the way so i have my shampoo i've got washing liquid over here we've got tea lights because tea lights have to be done um that's soda crystals because they're really good for cleaning some bars of soap um toothbrushes under there dishwashing liquid which i need to get more of because my daughter stole some lighters because you always need lighters um again more shampoo i've got disinfectant here more laundry liquid and down here dishwasher tablets and wash nut powder so yeah that's the bit i forgot to show you last night but it is supremely important so please do not neglect um as you can see again this but daughter has already been here we're down to one lighter um but as I say, yeah, we've got um, toothbrushes and such, tin foil. Oh yeah, that bit down there is normally bin liners, but again, daughter's been in here. Um, so yeah, don't forget your non-food preps. Now I'm going downstairs to have a cup of tea, and while that's brewing, I will do the rest of the video, and I'll see you soon. <laughs> 